home. We're just a few hours away from President Obama's grassroots rally in Golden. Second visit in Colorado in just one month. 7 News reporter Eric Looper is live for us in Golden. And Eric, the president's going to speak there a little later this morning. And we're already starting to see plenty of activity here this morning. I'm going to step out of the shots, show you what's going on. An officer just arrived about two blocks east of the park here, uh, directing traffic. And you can also see the flashing sign. Parking restrictions go into effect starting at 6 o'clock this morning. Again, obviously a lot of activity already. The sun hasn't even come up yet. The president will be here in five and a half hours. Take a look at some video. 7 News was there when Air Force One landed just before 10 o'clock last night at Buckley Air Force Base. Come 11 o'clock this morning, he'll be here at Lions Park. The economy will be a major talking point, but what about the attacks on the U.S. consulate in Libya and in, the sea in Egypt? We talked about this earlier in the hour. That has now turned into political attacks between the president and Mitt Romney, who is using these incidents to question the president's foreign policy. He really brought that home in Florida yesterday. Now, of course, the president has condemned the attacks, but Romney's comments have helped with his support base, so that really could change the feel of today's speech when the president arrives here in Golden at 11 o'clock this morning. Of course, 7 News will be here. Follow 7 News and the DenverChannel.com for all the updates during today's rally. Mitch. All right, Eric, thank you. It's 534 now, and while the president's here in Colorado, we're going to have Vice President Joe Biden's going to be speaking at an awards gala. He'll be in Washington, D.C. Mitt Romney's going to hold a rally in Virginia, and his vice presidential candidate, Paul Ryan, he is going to be campaigning today in Wisconsin.